What is up you guys? Welcome back to another Dawn of Titans episode. So, uh, sorry for not uploading the past week or so. Um, I blame it mainly due to homework. The amount of homework I get per, like, I guess week, like per day, it's insane. So I have eight classes per day, meaning that I get homework from every single class daily. So that's quite insane. And I'm also doing the IB diploma. So that's like triple the amount of work I need to do. I don't even know how the teachers come up with such homework assignments. I really don't know. Sometimes I feel like they really don't help. So enough of me rambling. Obviously, I'm still playing the game. And I am currently castle level 8 and XP wise level 11. So yes, I've been working. So let's quickly request. Alright, cool. So it's mostly going to be like a more of a mellowed out episode today, I don't think I'm going to be raiding, because I have a shield. So instead of that, I'll just take you around the base and tell you guys what I've upgraded so far, because it's been a week, and for this game, a week's been a long time. So, just to, I guess, go over, my army camp is level 5, meaning it can hold 70 troops, the temple Yes, I got that. And then barracks. This is a new barracks. New from the other two. So I'm currently still upgrading that. Lions camp. Level 4. Good enough. I, ha I have an arcane tower. I don't think I had it the last episode. This is basically for spells, upgrading spells. And uh, yeah, look here. I can upgrade the shield. So I'm just going to upgrade it for the heck of it. Because I don't want to, like, be a prime target for people. And I really don't have anything to do with, uh, food for now. Because basically I have max troops, troop levels, and, like, 66 out of 70. So I really don't need farms or food production. Alright. So, barracks. New barracks. Because I just, I upgraded the, the castle maybe a few days ago. I don't know. I have a Mossamane Cavern, I guess that's what you call it. Level 1 though, meaning that I can now train Panthers. Okay, so Barracks, their Armory, just I'll open that up for you guys. Um, so far everything upgraded max level, for at least for this level of Armory. And uh, yeah, everything's level 8. So that's Gucci. Spellforge, I can craft spells now. A shield and a fireball. Uh, it's a builder's hut. Moving on. Gold reserve. You guys know what that is if you at least play the game. Oh, I guess if you don't. It basically protects gold from attack from being taken away. Granaries. Store. It's level 7 now. And yeah, they store food, obviously. My, uh, I guess, farms. Oh, I guess I can upgrade this. I'll hold on that. Gold mine. I think I've upgraded almost all my farms. Or not, not all my farms. Sorry, take that back. All my gold mines, because I need gold. I really don't need food, so. Uh, I'll be upgrading the farms. Probably like, it'll be one of the last things I do before I move on to the next uh, castle. So the thing with me, it's like, I guess you can call it OCD. I'm not really sure. I want everything to be maxed before I move on to the next castle. It makes sense because I've been playing games like Clash of Clans and I usually do that. Except for walls because walls are terrible. Just increasing volume, alright. So Garrison as well, level 7. This is on my to-do list because, you know, I'll have level 8 defenders. And portal, portal stones, so I can actually upgrade this. So, I mean, uh, I'll hold on this, 
And instead, tomorrow, I'll be upgrading the garrison. And, uh, that's it for that. Let's go into the hall. Level two. Okay. Level two, I believe. Uh, yeah, level two out of seven. That's pretty cool. Alright, cool animation. So, meaning that I can hold a hundred titans? Something like that. Where do you check? I forgot where you check. I guess you could check here. Yeah, oh, 220. 120, sorry. <laughs> 120 titans. I can hold a lot of titans. So, so far, let's get my best. So, I have these three level twos. Uh, I gained Katash from, I believe, it was like, I think it was one of the Titan Arenas. Nexus from the, I guess the event we just had, forgot the name of it, Winter Souls event or something like that. And Runa I actually got from a battle, which was quite surprising. Actually, I think I got Katash from the free... I guess chest or free like offering at the temple that, that you get every day. I think it was during like the time where uh, you get like 10% more chance or 10 times more of a chance of getting level 2 titans or something like that. So besides these three, I have quite a bit of like level 1s. I have two Torix, Kron, Kobar, two Kobars, Halric, he's like I guess my uh, best titan. Level wise, level 20 it took me maybe like a week or something to level him up, but that was because I fused other times into him, and also there was some sort of event for um, times 10 or something about that with XP and Titans, or like an increase of XP. So, I guess the second best would be a Ares. Ares. So I'm working on her currently. She's level 12, almost level 13, and she's an archer, or a ranged, I guess. What do you call it? Yeah, a ranger. <laughs> so, a ranged unit. Wait, let's select her. Let's bring her out. Yeah, a ranged unit. And my current relic for her is Titan Armor, because she is quite squishy, or like very feeble, meaning that even like a gust of wind will like knock her down. So, that's what I was doing. And I don't have like another relic. Pot, which I hope I could fuse and I get something out, hopefully. But uh, holding on that, because I can hold a lot of titan, a lot of titans. So a level two Dralric, Dralic, and I have like two more of them. Dimash, I have like four, yeah, four of them. Kairos, Ast Astrid, level three. I have one of them, level three. Oh my god! Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, holy cow, I have seven of her. All right, three, or five, five Argax, Argax. And then, whoa, <laughs> sorry about that. All Nox, a lot of Alrax, Elena, Aldwin. And then just these three titans. Um, actually, I'm kind of curious as per what their skills are. Oh, that sounds so cool. Titan armor priest thing. And I believe, yeah, he's an infiltrator. Yeah, so. I guess I need to level them up soon. <laughs> Alright. So, me... Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is quite funny. So, I go down this list, right? So, yeah, that's, that's like my hits. So, this, the first one uh, with Stephen Cool. Yeah, that's quite a bit of gold and, uh, I guess, food taken away. So, I need to revenge that later on. So the funny thing is that this guy, uh, from Stars 364 Cap Tack, so he hit me once in a defendant, or my garrison defended. Alright? And he hits me again. 
and I st my garrison's still defended. And then this guy attacks me again. And finally my, I guess, uh, thing goes down. But even then, he didn't even take more than 10k of a certain uh, resource. So I was like, what? Makes no sense. And just for perspective, I'll show you guys what I have. So I have a level 8, no, no, level 8 Titan. And uh, like, the only thing substantial is probably the three Grenadiers, or like three Grenadier groups. And that, that's actually pretty much it. The rest are just like the regular castle defenders. And uh, two archers and one spearman that I actually put in with the mix. Uh, with the three grenadiers. Uh, also, I also have, uh, I guess, upgraded my lands. So, I think the farms of Conan was the same. The mines of that is the same, I believe. And this is pretty big. Mines of Mallet. 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 Mal match, mal match, uh, uh, which makes around 900 per hour, 908. So then the farms been there, Del Rion been there, and uh, this is my new addition, more than 1,000 per hour, which is insane. I probably should have a higher Titan level. I'm like meh because I have two Goliaths and two Grenadiers. That I put in. So I'm like, I'm thinking that should be enough. Hopefully. No one's attacked it yet. Thankfully. And I get a thousand per hour. That's insane. So, like, I sleep tonight, get up tomorrow, and that's like 8,000 right there just from this mine. So that's insane. So, enough of me rambling on. I really don't want to attack in multiplayer though. So instead. Let's head on to the arena, and let's take out uh, Okay, let's go, let's go easy, and take this out. Oh, that sounds cool. I'll be upgrading him later on, though. I want my ranger. Where's the, well, hmm, I guess, well, ranger. There you go. Yeah, I'll take her instead. It's just level two troops, so like one panther, uh, militia, grenadiers. That's, that's too much. Like, grenadiers were like pretty much my favorite. So what I'm trying to do here is like make sure none of my units get hit. Just like that, cleared it out. Um, as I said, I didn't want any of my troops to get hit, so I just used the rangers, like insane range, and just sniped everything. And those troops are only level 2, so that really didn't matter too much. Uh, uh, so that was just like, I guess for entertainment purposes only, and me to just, I guess, continue grinding. Uh, in terms of like, 
my clan. I'm still like with the same clan. I I don't know. I, I feel like if I go higher up, I'll get hit even more. And like higher up in leagues, I feel like I'll just get like smacked even more. And that would like make me lose interest of the game itself. So that's why I'm down here in, uh, I don't even know, yeah, Silver League. So, yeah, like, oh, just like an, an active clan, pretty much. Except for Lac... Lacrimasoa. He's like the only guy, consistent guy, who like gives me troops. And the rest are pretty much done for. We actually took this clan from the Bronze League, like me and the guy I mentioned, like the guy on top of me. So, yeah. That's pretty much it. So, more of a rambling, I guess, in, in this episode. But hope you guys um, enjoyed it, and hope you guys, like, I guess, caught up with my improvements in the base. So, tomorrow, hopefully, I will come up with an Armageddon gameplay video. This is a different game, and if you don't know what it is, you can, uh, I think I made a video about it. Yeah, I made a video about it. You guys can check that out if you're like an Armageddon. Or not Armageddon. If you're a Dawn of Titans fan. So maybe you, will, you might like that. It's an FPS. More or like it. FPS. But not actually first person. Third person. And it's still in beta. Yeah. So hopefully that comes tomorrow. And this will come out. Uh today and i believe it's the 22nd or something like that <laughs> all right guys thanks for watching please like comment subscribe you know the usual things and uh peace